Hey, what's up, everybody? I got some news for you guys today. And the Detroit Lions has signed a new cornerback, Jamar Summers. Let's get right into the video. Alright, before we get into the video, I would like to give you guys a quick announcement about the Madden tournament that I'm going to be doing on a PS4. So yes, it is only on the PS4 at this point. I don't have an Xbox right now, but hopefully at some point I get an Xbox and we could set that thing up. and PS4, so we're just going to do that tournament. I'm probably going to give people today for the last day to like add me as a friend. I mean, you can keep adding me as a friend after today, um, but this may be the last day before I make up the bracket. I'll make up a bracket and then I'll find a time that works for us to hold the tournament. I'll probably put another community post like the last one that you used to add me as a friend. I'll put a community post there as a picture of the bracket and then probably a day that we can, you know, start it and then we can just kind of discuss what's the best day for us. Is it a weekend? Is it a weekday? We'll figure all that out. But today is probably the last day to get in. So if you want to get in, add me as a friend. I'm going to have to go through and see who actually has Madden 20 because I have all these friends on there. Some of you guys don't have Madden and it's kind of like, kind of confusing. So if you have a Madden 20 and you have a PS4 and you want to be in a tournament, make sure you add me as a friend on PS4. Uh, I'll have it down here. That is my PS4 gamer tag. So make sure you guys add me there. Um, also, if you don't have Madden 20 and have a PS4, get Madden 20 so you can be in a tournament. It's just going to be for bragging rights. This first one, it should be very fun. Uh, but now let's get into the video. So the Detroit Lions have signed a new cor cornerback, Jamar Summers. And Jamar Summers is a guy that's very young, 24 years of age. While doing this, they also had to release cornerback Marcus Cooper. And I thought Marcus Cooper was a pretty solid cornerback. At one point, not, not really anymore, but I thought at one point this guy would have a chance to make the team. Well, Marcus Cooper, apparently not. He was waived and they brought in a new cornerback, Jamar Summers. They're definitely going to move guys in and out to try. Haven't really seen a lot of moves with the offensive line yet. That's kind of what I'm waiting for. But it looks like, again, they're kind of happy with their in-house options. I thought they would make some moves to go get some new offensive linemen, but I guess not. But I guess staying in the cornerback robe of things, Jamar Summers is a guy that went to UConn at college. And at UConn, he played both cornerback and safety. So he's definitely a versatile type of player in the defensive side of things. Then going into his professional career, he was a five foot ten and a half cornerback weighing 193 pounds and he ran a 455 40 yard dash. Now everybody has heights differently. I've looked at so many different things with so many players, and everybody has different heights. I'm like, how do you guys have three inches off? So just Look it up. Believe what you want to believe. Some people say 6'1". I've seen 5'10 and a half. I, I really don't know how that happens. But anyways, he came and ended up with the Pittsburgh Steelers as an undrafted free agent. He then ended up in the AAF. And as we all know, the AAF is pretty interesting. And he played for the Birmingham Iron. And he was one of the top cornerbacks, I guess you could say, in the AAF. He then ended up with the Miami Dolphins, where he signed after being there. And now he is with the Detroit Lions. So, I thought this was pretty interesting, bringing in another cornerback in the AAF. He did have one interception and a forced fumble in two games starting. So, again, not a lot of film on this guy. He's pretty new, but it is nice to see some young talent in here. We'll see what he can do. Um, we've had Marcus Cooper for a little bit now, so I guess we're just bringing in new quarterbacks to see what happens. I thought I would get that news out to you guys. Again, with the PS4 thing, make sure you guys add me as a friend. If you have any questions, just let me know in the comments of this video, or I guess you can hit me up on Instagram. Make sure you go follow me on Instagram, too because I want to do some cool things over there. And we'll probably have a lot of information over there if I have a lot of followers over there. Because if I don't have a lot of followers, I'm not going to put information over there because most of you guys won't even see it. That's why I'm doing it over here. So you guys just let me know if you have questions in the comments below. Uh, but that was some of the news I thought I would get out to you guys this morning. Or not really morning anymore. But thank you, Prof, for watching, and I'm out.